spherometer. Introduction A spherometer is an instrument based on the principle of a screw and specially designed to determine the radius of curvature of a spherical surface. It can also be used to determine the thickness of a thin sheet. It consists of a small triangular or Y-shaped metal frame supported on three legs. The tips of the legs form an equilateral triangle. A screw of fine pitch passes through a nut at the center of the frame. The axis of the screw passes through the centroid of the equilateral triangle. The main scale is marked on a small vertical metal strip attached to the frame. It has its zero at the center and may be marked in centimeter and graduated either in millimeters or in half millimeters. A circular disc is fitted to the screw head. The circumference of the disc is divided into 100 or 50 equal parts. The vertical metal strip itself is used as a reference line to read the circular scale. A spherometer can have a zero error which corresponds to the reading when all the four tips, those of the legs and screw, touch a plane surface. In practice, a measurement corresponds to the observed reading for a given surface minus that for the plane surface. Spherometer can be used to measure radius of curvature R of a lens. If A is the mean distance between the legs and H is the sagitta, then the radius of curvature R is given by R is equal to H upon 2 plus a square upon 6H. Aim To determine the radius of curvature of a spherical surface using a spherometer. Apparatus A spherometer A plain glass plate A convex lens A small metric ruler preferably of 0.5 mm least count. Procedure Let us first measure the mean distance between the legs of the spherometer. Place the spherometer on a plain paper and press it gently so as to get impression of the tips of the three legs. Mark these pricks as A, B and C. Measure the distances AB, BC and AC using the scale. AB is equal to 4.0 cm. BC is equal to 4.0 cm. AC is equal to 4.0 cm. The mean distance A between the tips of the legs is given by A is equal to AB plus BC plus AC upon 3 is equal to 4.0 plus 4.0 plus 4.0 upon 3 is equal to 4.0 centimeter. Therefore, mean distance between the legs of the spherometer A is equal to 4.0 centimeter. Let us measure the pitch of the screw of spherometer. Give 10 rotations and find the displacement of the edge of the circular disc on the main scale. The disc moves a distance of 1.0 cm on the main scale. Hence, the pitch of the screw P is given by pitch of the screw P is equal to total distance moved L upon number of rotations 10 is equal to 1.0 centimeter upon 10 is equal to 0 0.1 centimeter. Note the number of divisions on the circular scale N is equal to 100. 
Now, the least count LC is given by LC is equal to pitch of the screw P upon number of divisions on the circular scale N is equal to 0.1 centimeter upon 100 is equal to 0.001 centimeter. Now, raise the screw and place the spherometer on the plain glass plate. Lower the screw till its tip just touches the glass plate. Note the main scale reading A as the value of the main scale division just below the disc of the circular scale. The main scale reading is A is equal to 0, 0.00 centimeter. Note the circular scale division B which coincides with the main scale. Hence, calculate the circular scale reading C. And the total reading A plus C. Take at least three independent readings for the same surface, each time raising the screw and lowering it. The mean of these readings, Y0, is often called the zero reading or reference reading. Now, raise the screw and place the spherometer on the given spherical surface. Lower the screw till its tip just touches the curved surface. The spherometer should not wobble on any three tips. Take three readings. Find the mean of three readings Y for the curved surface. Calculations Let us calculate Sagitta H of the spherical surface using formula H is equal to mod Y minus Y0 is equal to 0 0.187 minus 0 0.057 is equal to 0 0.130 centimeter. The radius of curvature R of the spherical surface is given by the formula R is equal to H upon 2 plus A square upon 6H. Let us substitute values of H and A in the equation. Therefore, R is equal to 0 0.130 divided by 2 plus 4 square divided by 6 multiplied by 0 0.130 is equal to 0 0.065 plus 20.54 is equal to 20.61 centimeter. Results Radius of curvature of the spherical surface R is equal to 20.61 centimeter. Notes and precautions 1. Note the spherometer reading when the tip of the screw just touches the plane surface or the spherical surface as the case may be. This can be ensured by making the tip of the screw coincide with its image obtained by reflection from the top surface. This image is usually very faint but you will still see it if you look at a low angle. 2. Measure A accurately. Note that the expression for R involves A square. 